all about REDCap user rights. REDCap is really flexible in that you can have as many users as you need with as many different types of rights as necessary. To add a new user, on the left hand pane, go to the user rights section and you'll come to this window here. And you'll see your username um, with all of your user rights as the first user. And to add a new user, you can either begin typing their name, uh, and if they've signed into our REDCap before, you'll see their name, uh, and I can add them with custom rights. Or if you're going to have the same role, uh, I might create that role, such as a research assistant, create the role, and then I can assign the different user rights that are necessary. Uh, and this is whether or not someone can change your project, uh, how much of the data they can see, what they can do with the data, what they can do with records. Um, it really depends on whatever the, the user needs to be able to do. If you're, if you're going to have a statistician, um, that person might only need to be able to export the data, view the data, uh, but not necessarily change user rights or, or access the project design and setup. Um, so when I have those user rights, like I like them, uh, again, I can assign a user and then assign to the role that I've created. And so we see here that this person is now a research assistant. And you can add as many different types of people uh, as many people as you want to as many different types of roles as you like. You can also um, set users to expire after a certain amount of time um, as well.